welcome to Cox Local Edition on CNN Headline News. I'm Catherine Falk with Cox Communications. Thank you so much for joining us today. We have two special guests, Lisa Reeves, the President and CEO of Easter Seals of the Greater Washington Baltimore Region. And we also have John Horowitz. John is the VP of Strategic Finance at Capital One and also a board member for Easter Seals. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having us. Thank you, Catherine. Absolutely. So Lisa, tell us about Easter Seals and their mission. Well, Catherine, Easter Seals began in 1919, and I think we are a very well-known name, but maybe people don't know exactly what it is we do. And certainly in those early years, we were primarily serving children with disabilities and helping those children succeed in life. Uh, and in the early years, those were children with polio. I think that's what we're often associated with. But polio's been cured. And so since that time, Easter Seals has grown into serving children with other developmental disabilities such as autism and of course now we're serving older generations as well so our mission is to help people with disabilities of all ages live learn work and play successfully independently in their communities and how do you help these um, different groups of people in our community young and old how do you provide services or, or where do you provide services to them uh, in, in Northern Virginia, uh, we have nine centers in Falls Church, Fairfax, and in Arlington. Uh, and these are child development centers, early education, and child care centers that serve children with a whole array of disabilities as well as children without disabilities. Because by bringing children with and without disabilities is really the best way to serve both of these groups of children. Uh, we also are serving increasingly, um, and our other eight centers serve older adults with Alzheimer's disease, disease uh, adults who have had stroke, uh, and other age-related disabilities. Uh, and we serve their caregivers as well. That's great, and, and probably something that most people didn't know that Easter Seals was serving older people. Yes, well, Easter Seals uh, is here in the community to respond to the needs of the community. In 1919, our, gen our older generation uh, wasn't there for us to uh, serve, and they didn't need us. But today, who better than Easter Seals? We know how to help people be independent and live their lives with dignity, and we know how to serve whole families. So Great. these nine centers in Northern Virginia um, are here, and we hope people will call us and learn more. Great, and, and John, how do they provide the services? How do you guys go about this? Well, it's really a combination of government support that helps provide the baseline level of service, and then the investment of people in our community that enable us to really go a step beyond. And a lot of people, when you think about a charity like Easter Seals, think, how is it an investment? And so I'm going to share a little story that explains why I think the time and money that I devote to Easter Seals is really an investment in the community. So Carl Weyer, for example, is a client of ours and uh, was a World War II veteran. And he came to Easter Seals after he suffered a stroke. And he needed um, assistive technology services as well as um, physical therapy. And uh, we were able to provide those services for less than $20,000 a year, whereas the government, uh, sorry, the nursing home would have been over 100000 a year. Great. And so during 10 years with Easter Seals, the savings was almost a million dollars. Great. And how can people learn more about what Easter Seals is doing and how they can help assist you in this? Well, the simplest way is probably to go to our website, www.gwbr, which stands for Greater Washington Baltimore Region, .easterseals.com. And that's a site that can help caregivers, people with disabilities, or employers who need help providing uh, caregiver support. Great. And I'm sure you would always welcome uh, volunteers and contributions as well. Yes. Great. Thank you both so much for thank joining you. us today. And thank you for joining us on Cox Local Edition on CNN Headline News. Have a great day.